What's up photographers, I'm Blake Stockton, a small biz marketing consultant and in this video I'm going to talk about the best website builder for your photography business and my five reasons why I like that website builder over all the others. And there's a lot of different ones out there, right? You might be feeling a little bit confused right now, a little overwhelmed with all the options, but this video is hopefully going to make it a little bit more simple for you to understand. And these five reasons that I'm going to discuss are based off of me meeting with hundreds of different clients, consulting them with digital marketing, many of which were photographers. So I understand the photography business. I have a good idea of what you're looking for in a website. So what's my number one recommended platform? Keep watching to find out. All right, screw it. Let's enough of the teasing. Let's just get into my number one website builder for photographers, which is Wix. And my number one reason for that is the crazy amount of website templates available for photographers, okay? They have dozens of different websites. And the reason why I like all the templates because as someone you know, in the field meeting with small business owners, people who are not very tech savvy, who are anywhere I'd say from a two, three out of 10 up to a six out of 10, uh, the highest likelihood you will have of success for building your own website is finding a template that you have to change the least. And that's why I like Wix, because they have so many templates available. You can spend a few hours finding that perfect template for your business, and when you find it, you wanna change it the least. Because real quickly, this is what I see commonly with people who aren't very tech savvy uh, with their websites. They'll pick their website, right? They'll get very, or website builder, they will get very excited and they will find a template and they'll start changing things and colors and fonts and layouts and photos, uh, just little things. And then what happens is the website looks like a disaster. They spent three hours on it or more maybe, and it just is not congruent. It does not look good. It's not something you want to present to the public. So if you can find a template that you can change the least and just add your photos, your own personal photography photos, your own descriptions and information about what you do, then you will have I won't say you will succeed or fail, that's too black and white, but you're more likely to succeed building your own website and not paying someone to do it for you with that perfect template. So let's, or finding that template you like the most. So let's jump into some of these templates and show some of them off. I will make one quick distinction. Sometimes people call them themes versus templates. They're fairly interchangeable. So you might hear the word theme and template uh, used to describe the same thing. So let's go ahead and check out some of these templates for Wix. Here we are looking at a fairly modern template for a photographer. You can see here, you just add your photos, they're showing off the work. You, it, it's, it's definitely a modern look and feel a little bit different so you can separate yourself from other you know, businesses, other photography businesses out there. And if you have that modern kind of um, the word I'm really looking for is trendy feel, then this would be a great option for you. Uh, you know, here's something a little bit more where you could show off more of your photos. This is that family photography type of theme and you can show off your photos right from the beginning. Uh, very, a little bit different. You know, the modern theme right now for website is one big picture across the board, but here they're breaking it down to several photos uh, instead of that one big photo. Here's an example of that big photo. This is more for food and photography, but what's cool about this, I just wanted to show it off as well, that you can sell your products uh, within Wix as well. It's also the e-commerce capabilities. So you can sell your um, books as well, and we'll get into selling some of the photographs and portraits themselves. One thing to think about when you're choosing a template is how it looks in mobile. Many of my clients, almost all of them, have more people visiting their website on mobile than their computer, some of which are 70 up to upwards to 70%. So you want to make sure that it looks good on the mobile version. Here you can see we have it broken down pretty nicely. The photos are taken up the whole uh, the whole phone, which is nice to set up. And then you can see your your photos are here as well. Uh, organized quite nicely. The photos are really showcasing what you got going on here. My second reason to choose Wix is the gorgeous portfolio sections. So photography websites have really come a long way in the last couple years in that you can do things to show off your photos better than previously. You're not just uploading your photo and it's the static 
picture that you have to find that's perfect for when you're showing off the different photos and how they're organized. You can move them, you can um, tint, you can change a lot of things with the quality so the page will load faster depending on the size of the photo and all that. Whereas if you find some WordPress templates out there, they're going to be very rigid and very controlled in what you, how it can look. So you can have some flexibility here. Uh, showing off some examples, here you, here you can see a portfolio setup where the pictures are added to each other a little bit differently, right? It's not just, here's my list of photos, but you almost have a collage here. Uh, and you can edit these photos a little bit differently. Another example of a portfolio for a different template is this one right here. It has a darker background. These are the big pictures. But what's interesting is if I right click, you see that C there, your images are copyright, right? You People cannot save your photos, which that should be standard across the board. You definitely want to make sure that, that your, whatever you choose, whatever template you choose, whatever company, that that is an option available, that people can't just copy your photos or download your photos. The third reason why I like Wix over other website builders is the ability to create album sites for your clients. It's a great another benefit and service for your clients if you can let them view their pictures online. It's pretty common now. Uh, but it's also really good for SEO. If you can drive, I have a background in SEO, so I have some knowledge there. If you can drive clients to your website, right, and that gets you more people visiting your site than your competitors, or they're spending more time on your site than your competitors, and you can rank higher than potentially in Google. That's something called uh, dwell time, is something a factor Google looks at to rank websites. That's a whole nother video that I'll probably do in the future one day. Um, but for now, I really like these um, setup of these online album sites for your clients. The fourth reason why I like Wix is that you can get uh, clients to book appointments online. And I know as a photographer, you probably don't enjoy doing a lot of customer service. And if you could cut some of that out, that's more money you can make, more time spend doing the thing you love and taking photographs. So Wix has the opportunity to book online. And I know that sounds pretty good to you. So let's look at one of these real quick and just show you what it looks like. Cause I think the setup is pretty cool. Looking at this book a session here, you can break down your sessions by different services. And let's say, okay, I want to do a family photography session. So you click book it. It will take you to the calendar and you choose your date and you can see it's optimized nicely here. Like this is something that's kind of, you can see here quite simply, but if you, it looks like it's easy to put together, but if you asked a coder to put this together on a WordPress website, say, so that it follows around here, it's gonna cost you some cash, but this is built in to that Wix template. It's just something I'm pointing out here. So you can choose your date, choose your time. I mean, this looks pretty nice, right? It's, it's organized quite nicely, you click next, and it will take you to where that person, that potential client or your client can book that uh, next appointment with you. My fifth and final reason why I like Wix is something called Wix Arena. And Wix Arena is basically a marketplace where you can find vetted professionals to help you finish your website. And I know some of you, you know, you're gonna get frustrated, maybe you don't have time, maybe you're a little over your head as far as your tech uh, savviness, which is totally fine. Uh, you could be doing other things probably better spent with your time, getting your business ready up and running, or just running your business if you're trying to launch a new website. So you can go to this plot, this marketplace and find that vetted professional. And sometimes you can get very affordable prices because these people are around the world. So let's go ahead and look at some of these people and show you off a little bit how this works quickly. So here we are in Wix Arena. You can see it here at the top. And you can create a request to help to get someone to help build your website amongst some other things which we're gonna look at. And when you create this request, it actually goes out to six different Wix experts so they can all uh, compete bid on your project. So you fill out some fairly easy information here, but then you can really break down of what you need, changes to your site, complete redesign, a new website, e-commerce, uh, what kind of website do you want, which you can you know, there's a ton of different types of specialties here. Photography is one of them. There you go. Uh, your budget, which, you know, less than a grand, one to three grand, three plus grand, and some other details you could have. And then also maybe you need help with a new business logo, your website, Facebook business page. These professionals will help with that as well. Uh, but the six Wix experts, that's pretty nice because then you can start to compare and contrast to the different ones. 
Another option is to go and find them on your own. So maybe you're doing some exploring. These are all different experts within Wix and you can see, you can do some of your own exploring and reach out to them, uh, particularly like this person in Morocco. You can click on him and see what kind of websites he's done. Maybe you can find someone who's done uh, photography and then you can say, oh, I like that. I want that for myself as well. So this is a great way, just kind of as a, a fail-safe plan, if building your website, if you struggle with building your own website. That wraps up my five reasons of why you'd want to choose Wix as your website builder of choice for a photography business. If you want to get started with Wix today, click the link below and start cranking out that new website. If you have any questions about anything I talked about, or really, you know what, let's open it up. Let's open it up to any digital marketing questions. Leave a comment. If you watch this long, you deserve this, okay? Leave a comment in uh, below and I will be happy to answer from my expertise and point you in the right direction. Again, I'm Blake Stockton. Thanks for watching. Keep on crushing it.